I'm Chuck Boyd. I sing baritone. I'm Matt Stewart. I sing lead. I'm David England. I sing bass. I'm Matthew Stewart, and I sing tenor. It's great for Down the Lane to be here at Daywind and to share a little bit with you about the new project that we uh, have just recorded, and we're excited about it. Uh, it's the second time that we've uh, worked with Daywind, and we're uh, this is an all original project, and we're so excited to be able to share it with you. Uh, all the songs we're going to talk about uh, were written by Marty Funderburg. He also was the uh, producer of a project, and uh, we're just so excited to be able to uh, present some details about six of the songs that are on that project. Uh, but the title track uh, of the project is From Here to Heaven. And uh, I love the song, all of us, when we heard it. It's got a nice uh, snappy beat. And I love the message in it because it, it just talks about as we journey from here, from this life to heaven, uh, it just gives us something to be excited about. And I hope that when you hear it, that uh, it'll, it'll be exciting to you as well. And giving the rest of my life to the one who saved me for all the joy he gave me. From here to heaven, I'll keep on living for heaven. Be Christ is quickly becoming one of our more signature songs on the album. It's very popular. It's very short, but it's packed full of uh, strong message. No matter what our station in life, instead of just being churchgoers, instead of just being, uh, you know, believers in God, can we actually be Christ among the people that we interact with? At school, at work, in public, on the road, can we portray who Christ is and can we also magnify Him in our lives? Oh What Joy is just a really fun song for us, and I think it's a fun song for the people that are listening to it. When we start playing this song, it doesn't matter what church we're in, you just see people light up, they start they clapping. Start, they can't sit still. They can't sit still. It is just such an enjoyable song. And, you know, when we go into a church, we want to make sure that we share Jesus. We want people that don't know Him to come to that relationship before they leave. Or if they do know Him and they're away from Him, we want them to draw closer to Christ, but we also want the church to be encouraged. And this is just a fun, encouraging song that I think I think you'll love. Oh, what joy, what joy, one love divine, one love divine, to know that I am His and He is mine. Oh, what peace, oh, what, peace. what happiness, what happiness, I am thrilled, I'm filled, I am abundantly blessed. Every day of life I live by loving even more Oh, what joy to live and love the Lord You Died For Me is probably my favorite on the whole project. Um, as we sing the song, a lot of times when we're out uh, about singing the song, we always uh, think about things that Christ has done for us. And uh, the most important thing that I feel and realize is when, Matt, when you sing the song, uh, it just speaks to my heart and there's times where it's even hard to get through the song because of just how it speaks to my, my myself and uh, it's uh, it's one of those songs where the harmony is so tight and it just feel you can feel the presence of God and it talks about what he did for us Amen. and uh, it has a great message to it I love the song yeah, yeah it's one of my favorites Love Them Back to You is the one song we have probably received the most feedback on and it was the least expected. Mm -hmm. It's not your typical quartet song, 
and it's also a song that makes you really think. How many of us have fallen down spiritually, or we know of someone who has, and they've struggled, and maybe they're not even in church anymore, and they're hard to reach. And too often, we say and do nothing because we don't know what to say or what to do. The song, the message of the song simply says, instead of pointing a finger, can we lend them a hand? Yeah. Can we love them back to God and back to the fellowship and back to God's name? I'm not the judge, I'm not the jury. That's not who I'm called to be. For how can I condemn another when I consider me? You have shown me such compassion. Lord, I want to show it to you. If you can love me, I can love them back to you. I was presented a song by Marty that um, was one that I passed on when I heard it. And uh, the song's entitled, I Can Take the Trial. And I don't know if you guys felt the same way, but it for me, it wasn't a song when I first heard it. It's like, that's us. Mm -hmm. We need to do that song. And yeah, I would have passed on it, but I shared it with my wife, Alice, and my daughter, Amber. And Amber has a neuromuscular disease, and she's uh, lived 26 years longer than the doctors expected. But it's been a challenging life for her. But it's been a joyful life. But she heard this song. And when she heard it, um, when it was over, she looked up at me with tears in her eyes and she said, Dad, will you sing that song? And of course I said yes, and I'm so thankful that God spoke to her uh, through that song and touched her in such a way that I knew that we needed to do that song, the group needed to do it, because there is not one person that is watching this, there's not one person that will hear us sing that song that doesn't face a trial. It could even be a little one. But everyone has trials in their life, and this song will help all of us when we face a trial to know what to do, to not be defeated, to not get discouraged, but to come through that trial and have joy instead of sorrow. I'll take the gun with the bag and trust you through it all, for I know On behalf of all the guys, I'd like to say thank you for taking the time to watch the video. I know your time is precious. Uh, if you like our music and you like what we've presented, please give us a call. We'd love to come share our ministry with you. For more information about Down and Lane, the easiest way to get in touch with us is on the web. It's downandlane.com. D-O-W-N-I-N lane.com. You can find us there. You can communicate with us. Subscribe to any newsletter or communication that we have. And like Dave said, we'd love to come be with you. Please call. Our kids need to eat. <laughs> <laughs> we need to eat too. Yeah. And look, we're getting fed. Living for him.